There are a few things I hate purchasing as much as UPSs. Uh, uninterruptible power supplies, you know, they're never cheap for good ones and there is absolutely no instant gratification from the purchase. Uh, but in order to keep your gear running during power outages and in, in my case uh, to also be able to gracefully shut down my hypervisor in case of a power outage, uh, a good UPS is pretty indispensable. So when something like this Liebert 1500 watt um, commercial grade UPS comes across my desk um, because basically somebody had this and they were going to throw it away. My guess is that it just needs to have the batteries replaced and I will have myself basically a brand new uh, UPS that at the moment is retailing on Newegg for $800. So not a bad proposition considering that I've spent south of $80 on the replacement batteries which you can see to the left of the UPS there. So a little bit of soldering and uh, hopefully we'll be good to go. Basically, we've already taken off the front panel and here's the existing battery bank. Um, I looked these up online and got some replacements from Amazon. We've got a little bit of uh, plastic molding around the side here and some friction tape holding it all together. So now we're going to go ahead and break this apart and uh, solder it up to our replacement batteries. Got three of these bad boys. Part of what makes this so nice is that after doing some research on this particular UPS, I found out that it is compatible with ESXi and should allow me to do a graceful shutdown of all of my VMs which is something that up until now I've been accomplishing a different UPS. As you can see over here kind of in the corner there we have uh, a CyberPower uh, PureSign UPS that we configured basically using instructions from Paul Brayron on the TinkerTry website and we've been using that but Got a feeling this Liebert is going to be a lot better overall. One other thing to note here is we have a interface card that came with this with an RJ45 adapter on it. I'm guessing this is going to give me some sort of uh, extra network control over this piece. Uh, we're going to have to do a little research into that, pull it out, see exactly what it is. But, um, you know, those cards are never cheap as well, and I know they don't come with the, the UPS, so a little bit of bonus. Alright, well we're going to get started on uh, replacing the battery.